Today we are going back in time into the last 10 Madden games to score a touchdown with the fastest player in every single game. Our first Madden up is Madden 25, the release back in 2013. I know 2025 hasn't happened yet. This was the 25th anniversary of Madden. Go check it out if you don't believe me. But our fastest player to start off this video is CJ2K, Chris Johnson from the Tennessee Titans. He was five years in the league at this point, but he comes with 99 speed, 95 agility, 98 excel. I imagine once we get to like Madden 19, Tyreek Hill is going to dominate this, but I'm very curious to see for the next few Maddens who's the fastest in the game. So this is the first play that I'm going to use Chris Johnson here in the backfield, and we get stopped on third down. I played a couple of plays because I had to get the thumbnail information to get his picture, so that was my first actual play using him, and he only goes for one yard. Can we pick up the first at least? There we go, CJ2K. Chris Johnson, two rushes, 12 yards. I want to see if we can get him to the outside possibly to see that speed. And on a fresh set of downs, this is what I'm looking for here. I'm looking to get Chris Johnson out to the left. Turn on the speed. Okay. Break a tackle. Can we see that 99 speed? He isn't quite flying like a Tyreek Hill would in the next few Maddens. I want to see what he can do. I want to see that speed. I want to see him reach that 99 speed down the sideline and just cruise to the end zone. Give me some blocking. Oh, here we go. Throw one block, Chris Johnson. Oh, you're kidding me. I expected way more speed right there. I don't know. I feel a little disappointed right now. I thought he was going to fly past that defender, just walk into the end zone. Here we go again to the outside. Okay, it looks like he has more speed this time. Still can't quite get to the end zone, but five rushes, 61 yards, and a couple good runs back to back. Now, can he find his way into the end zone? Oh, my Lord. That was insane. And then he gets in this time. On to the next Madden. There are so many players in Madden 15 with 98 speed that are the fastest players in this game. We have Deshaun Jackson, Chris Johnson, Mike Wallace, Jeff Dems, don't remember him. Dry Archer. We have Demarcus Van Dyke, don't remember him. Patrick Peterson, obviously, is going to be a Hall of Famer. Trendon Holiday, Ontario Mikalev, I don't remember him. So what we're going to do, because we have so many players with 98 speed, we are going to bring up a wheel to decide who to use. All right, so we have the wheel. Now we need to know who we're going to be using and it's going to be Jeff Dems who I do not remember whatsoever so with the Colts playbook this year I could actually play Dems at the Wildcats so I thought that would be pretty fun and is it me or is he super small is it me or is he super small I don't know why he didn't seem as small when the players actually started running and all that but I swear at the initial Wildcat formation I don't know if it's Madden 15 because T.Y. Hilton looks really small too but he looks so small and I didn't realize I was even gonna pass that completely forgot about that can we hit him on a screen pass the run isn't really working the wildcats not really working how about a screen go Demps go Demps 98 speed down the sideline he's breaking tackles like crazy all of a sudden he became a legend on that play okay the screen was the way to go with Demps right there Oh my, he was going right there. Have to take him out of the game here for a second. We got to pick up this first. We have Reggie Wayne or T.Y. Hilton. Where are we going to go? T.Y. Hilton, now a member of the Dallas Cowboys, but he makes a play for us. Definitely struggling to pick up yards now. So I'm just going to have to get us to the goal line here. Can we do it? Get us down to about the nine yard line. Can we go to the screen pass again? Can we find nine yards here? He had one good play. That was pretty much it. But maybe here on the screen, we get the blocking we need, and Dems is in the end zone. For Madden 16, we have a player that was not even part of the top eight fastest players last year, and that's because he's a rookie this year in Madden 16, Brashad Perriman of the Baltimore Ravens with 97 speed. And Brashad Perriman get open one-on-one -on -one with Earl Thomas. He cannot come up with the catch. We're trying to just burn the Legion of Boom right now. Can we get past him? We're going right back to it. This game is so slow. This is probably the slowest Madden game out of any of the Maddens I have played. So even 97 speed feels so slow sometimes. But here we go. Brashad Perriman. He makes the catch. What a catch right there by Brashad Perriman. But couldn't keep going as he caught the ball. I'm going right back to it though. I want to see. Can we get open over the top one more time? Or is Earl Thomas going to shift over our way and crush us? We're not open and we're throwing it out of bounds. Pick up some yards here. Nice. Oh, come on, Perriman. How do you drop that? What a perfectly timed throw by Joe Flacco, too. You can't drop that. We would have picked up probably about 15, 20 yards right there. Maybe even got into the end zone. We're feeling a little lucky, but you got to catch that. This time, Earl Thomas is lurking on our side. Can he really catch this? This time, he makes that catch. What a perfect throw again by Joe Flacco. Pass led that perfectly towards the sideline. 
And now can Flacco deliver an easy slant right here? Perriman, can you get open on a slant? I almost caught that with the wrong guy. I would have been mad. Definitely want to make sure I catch it with the right guy. There's Perriman. Oh my, that easily could have been intercepted. I don't know why he lobbed that up, but a nice catch. For Madden 17, we have a five-way tie with five players having 96 speed. Don't remember a lot of these guys. Philip Dorsett, I do remember. Jakeem Grant, I remember. Dry Archer, not really. JJ Nelson, not really. And Corey Grant. So let's see which one we're going to be using. Whatever the wheel says goes. And who are we going to be using here? It's either JJ Nelson or Dorsett. It's going to be J.J. Nelson of the Arizona Cardinals. So we have J.J. Nelson on the field with Larry Fitzgerald in Arizona. And let's see what that 96 speed can do. Can he fly? There he goes. J.J. Nelson. Oh, they're not going to catch him. They're not even close. Bang. That fell really, really fast. I'm not even going to lie. This game actually Madden 17 normally for me when I use it or when I play it isn't very fast. He had all that open space and he went straight to the end zone. Let's watch that one again. That is an easy touchdown right there. That is what I like to see. Yeah, they had no chance of catching him there. For Madden 18, we have a rookie, John Ross, that just beats out Tyreek Hill, second year in the league with 98 speed. I imagine, though, Tyreek, maybe next year or the year after that, is going to dominate this video going forward. John Ross. I remember drafting John Ross in fantasy one year. Everybody always thought he was going to, like, break out this upcoming year, and then it became the next year, then it became the next year. But he can definitely fly. John Ross can definitely fly. He gave you a few deep shots once in a while that made you question why he's not like an everyday starter and why he's not playing currently in the league. But in a lot of bad games too. But can he get open right here? We're sending him deep. We are going to hit John Ross. What a throw. Andy Dalton. That's what John Ross can do. In Madden 19, it is Tyreek Hill. And I imagine going forward, it's pretty much going to be Tyreek Hill every single game. Maybe somebody else ties him at some point. Then we'll see who else we're going to use. But I would imagine Tyreek Hill's probably going to be the fastest going forward. Let's start off Tyreek Hill with a quick slant. Oh, he got drilled. Oh, he got absolutely drilled right there. Okay, no more slants for Tyreek Hill over the middle. We're just going to bomb it over the top. See if he can get open with that 98 speed. Can we roll out with Mahomes? Can we throw it off the back foot? What a throw! Patrick Mahomes! I had a possession and I wasn't sure if he was going to overthrow him. But what a throw right there. I know we're playing on a lower difficulty. But you got to be kidding me. And early on, Patrick Mahomes rolling to the left off the back foot. Just threw that thing 63 yards. Absolutely insane. Absolutely insane by Mahomes. Another play action. I pass. Tyreek Hill. I miss seeing them together. Four Madden 20. As you already know, it's going to be Tyreek Hill now at 99 speed. If he stayed at 98, Marquise Goodwin of the 49ers this year would have caught him. Marquise Brown pretty close. John Ross as well, 97 plus. Ton of fast receivers in this game, but no one as fast as Tyreek. We are going to have some fun in Madden 20. We are going to use Tyreek Hill at the running back spot, or at the running back spot, at the Wildcat formation, and we're going to fly with Tyreek. Nobody's going to catch this man except for him. Except for him. But besides him, nobody's going to catch Tyreek Hill from this formation. Madden 20 Tyreek Hill might be the biggest glitch in sports history of video games. Just watch this man fly. See you later. Marshawn Lattimore. See you later. Nobody's <laughs> catching Tyreek Hill. It's that easy. Three more games to go. And Madden 21, I don't think Tyreek Hill is going to get caught going forward. I don't think there's anybody that comes to the league the next few years. Waddle. I don't think he's going to catch him. Miko Harmon's not going to catch him. Hollywood Brown's not going to catch him. Raheem Mostert, I don't think so. Marquise Goodwin. I think Tyreek Hill is pretty much going to be the fastest player for the rest of the video. So we just scored with him at the Wildcat spot. We threw the ball to him. Now can we get him like a jet touch sweep here? Little jet sweep. Nice move, Tyreek. I mean, this game is a lot slower than Madden 20, 100%. So I don't know if that's going to come into play a role here. I don't think he's going to score as quickly as he did in Madden 20. In 21, you're going to see how much slower this game is. So it might be a little more challenging. Let's go back to our normal pass here for Tyree. Quick drag route. Oh my, he is flying. One juke box. Oh, nice juke. But I double juke with Tyreek. I hate when you do that. You click the analog stick one time, the juke. Makes you juke twice. He absolutely flew on that drag too. And that was a nice juke move. Roll to your left, Tyreek. Okay, or Kaiser can catch it. We're on a deep crosser this time. Nobody's going to stay with him one-on-one. -on -one. Actually, he kind of is. But look at that pass by Mahomes. Oh, and he's just out of bounds. I possession caught that too. Tyreek Hill turned on another gear though. He got a ton of separation. I probably should have just waited to bullet that pass. I'm going to go right back to it. That was a... 
Really, really good throw by Mahomes, though. This time, Tyreek Hill with the catch. So close to being called again in Madden 22. We got Quez Watkins, 98 speed. Jalen Waddle, 97 speed. But nobody can catch this guy, Tyreek Hill, at 99 speed. This is Tyreek's final year on the Chiefs, though. So that's a little exciting. And we did bump up the difficulty. I bumped up the difficulty because this has been way too easy. Tyreek Hill is an absolute glitch. If you played Madden 04 and you remember Michael Vick, Tyreek Hill is way worse. Way more of a glitch in my opinion. The defense is going to play a little bit better here. Can we go over the top on an all Madden team right here with Jesse Bates in the secondary? I'm just going to throw it as far as I can. Yep, Tyreek's going to get that. Oh, we almost got it. Tyreek Hill literally ran for about 65 to 70 yards to almost catch that. What a throw by Mahomes that is too, by the way. That ball just kept on flying and flying and flying. That ball never wanted to come down. And that's a filthy throw by Mahomes. And did we get picked? No, we didn't. Did bumping up the difficulty change anything here? Maybe it did for Tyreek Hill. We'll see if he can pick up this fourth down for us, though. Yeah, I don't think it really changed much. It didn't change anything. It did not change a thing. All Madden Tyreek Hill still says, I'm going to the end zone. Just broke two tackles. Are you kidding me? Tyreek Hill, I need the replay. I need the replay. Fourth down, obviously we're going to him here. Corner man coverage gets cooked. Breaks that tackle, try to go for jukebox animation. Just the size he's gonna break that tackle. And then here comes Jesse Bates and four other Bengals trying to catch him. And nobody's gonna catch Tyreek Hill in a foot race. I don't know why, but when I thought about filming this video, why did I not realize that Tyreek Hill is gonna be the fastest player for like five years in a row? Again, so many players right behind him. Jamison Williams, 98. Tariq Woolen, 98. Jalen Waddle, 98 speed. Kalen Barnes, 97 speed. So there are a lot of young players in the league, like Jamison Williams, he's a rookie. Could get up to a 99 next year. Tariq Woolen could get up to a 99. Jalen Waddle maybe up to a 99. So maybe Madden 24 will get a different player, but once again, it's Tyreek. This guy is the biggest glitch in Madden history. Here we go. Dolphins time. Let's see what Tua can do. All right, Tua might get sacked, so I'm going to throw a pick. That is one way to stop Tyreek Hill is if you get to Tua and I can't throw the ball. Lucky that wasn't picked. That was Tyreek Hill and breaking that up because that probably should have been an interception. That was covered all the way. I'm stupid for even throwing that, but I decided why not just throw it. Try to let Tyreek Hill go make that play. I will throw this one, though. Oh, and I get hit. If I don't get hit right there, I think Tyreek Hill... Goes up and makes a play right there. Probably gets to that ball and scores. Let's try this route. Gonna be open here. Never mind. Okay. Never mind. I don't have Mahomes anymore. I gotta remember that. Go back to the corner route that works so good in Madden 22. It works good again. The closing speed. Almost great right there. It's almost break up that pass, but Tyreek Kill has good hands too. He doesn't just have speed. He's one of the best wide receivers in the league for a reason. There's a lot of guys with great speed, but there's only one Tyreek Kill. And that's broken up. And now I'm just going to throw this one right up the seams very quickly. Thread it to the left, Tua. Oh, it is intercepted. you got to be kidding me. Forget this. I can't believe that's picked. I mean, a great defensive play. I cannot believe that's picked. So we're just going to do this now. Tyreek Hill. If I bulleted that, is that a touchdown? He was getting pressed. He blew right past. He went right past that press coverage right there. So if I bulleted it, maybe that's a touchdown. Could be a mistake on my part. How about right now? Oh, can we catch that right there with Cedric Wilson, maybe? Oh, this time, though. Oh, two if we have one extra second, Tyreek's open. I threw five for 15 in this game. That is absolutely horrible. I went from having Mahomes and not even missing a throw to missing almost every throw. And I'm lucky Tyreek Hill just caught that. And he's only down at the one. I thought that was a touchdown. I really thought that was a touchdown. I just can't get in the end zone. Can we get in here? They're on Tyreek, but Tyreek still makes the grab 10 this one off. That's gonna do it for the video, everyone. If you enjoyed it, do me a favor, hit the like button, hit that subscribe button if you're new. In the comments down below, let me know what challenge, what video do you wanna see next? Peace.